What's going on guys? T Gaming here here to show you guys another video of Hogwarts Legacy. Last time we left off, we learned the great spell of Vada Kedavra, and now our entire spell list is complete. And we also did some missions after that. Um, so now my next thing is is I want to talk to Sebastian. I'm um, in the Undercroft, see what he has to say. And if there's nothing else with him, we're going to do the next trial. Um, but, uh, yeah, before we begin, and, well, since we'll be heading over there, um, I just wanted to say thank you guys for watching. Um, and if you do, or if you are enjoying my videos, I greatly, greatly appreciate it. And if you're new to the channel, um, please uh, hit that subscribe button down below. I greatly appreciate your support. Um, and if there's anything that you enjoyed from the videos, please let me know by hitting that like button down below. Um, oops, this is not the flipping Undercroft, dog. Where's the... Where are the secret rooms, kid? That is not it, dude. Well, I'll just go here. I went to the wrong room. But yeah, if there's anything that I should improve on in them or what things that you did enjoy from my video, I really want to hear your feedback. Um, just let me know down in the comment section down below. Tell me. Um, Whispers in my ear. I won't be upset. Ugh, fucking weird. But yeah, but anyways, I've been really enjoying this game, trying to spam out as much as I possibly can, especially with my pretty busy work schedule, so... Um, But don't worry, I am still trying to post out as many as I possibly can, so. She's devastated. She just buried your uncle alone. I did it for her. Sebastian, Anne can't bear the thought of turning you in, but... What? Turn me in? She saw what happened. I'll give you some time to think, Sebastian. Turn me in? Sebastian, did you hear that? You saw what happened. I never wanted to hurt my uncle. I know. I can't believe he's gone. How did things go so wrong? I didn't mean it. I didn't mean to... Oh, Anne, I was only trying to help. I can't leave now. Anne needs me more than ever. You understand. You can talk to Ominous. Make him understand. He listens to you. I need to be with Anne. Don't worry, Sebastian. I shall speak with Ominous. Thank you. You're a good friend, truly. No matter what happens from here, I'm glad we met. Poor Sebastian. Ominous? What a mess. I can't believe it. After I last saw you, I went straight to Hogwarts. Before I had time to talk to Black, I heard from Anne. I rushed to Feldcroft and found her with Solomon's body. She was beside herself with grief. Part of her wants Sebastian to face the consequences, another part can't bear the thought of it. I don't want to lose Sebastian, but I don't think we have a choice. We do have a choice. What good will it do to turn him in now? He clearly regrets everything. He's not going to do anything like this again. We've both heard that before. But we also need to think about Anne. She's lost her health. Now she's lost her uncle. Do you really want to take her brother away from her too? I... I understand what you're saying. Perhaps you're right. As much as I believe that Sebastian should pay for his actions, we'd only be punishing Anne as well. I hope we're doing the right thing. I'll talk to Anne. If it comes from me, she'll agree with this decision. Thank you, Ominous. You're a good friend. Yeah, that wouldn't really Whatever make sense lies ahead, to we must send him away, together. you know? That I know. Because then Anne will be by herself, so... I don't know, man. That's kind of a pretty crappy situation, so... Where are they at? They're in the map room, so... The map chamber. I apologize. 
Alrighty, let's go see what the what the keepers have I to say. I think got my owl. I need to tell him and the keepers that Ranrock knows where the last repository is. According to the owl I received, Ranrock is moving more quickly than we could have anticipated. This is grave news indeed. We had hoped for more time to discuss the best path forward. Let us hear what the student has to say. Professor, you received my owl. Ranrock has the last of Bragbor's journals. He killed Lodgok to get it. He knows where the last repository is. Godric's heart. Lodgok. Lodgok and Ranrock were brothers. Lodgok was bringing the journal to me. Ranrock is a monster. We need to know where the final repository is. Surely this changes things. Ranrock has Bragbor's journals and knows where the final repository is. We obliviated Bragbor. He kept journals? Why would he have documented all of this? He didn't know what we were containing. Ooh. Isadora told Bragbor about the magic when she asked him to build a container for her. I've seen her memories. Isadora left memories for someone to find? You know what she did? Her memories showed what she did for her father, which I also saw in Professor Rookwood's pensive. And a conversation with Bragbor in which she expressed frustration about the limits being placed on her use of ancient magic. Based upon the memories they have seen, I believe our young friend is well aware of the grave circumstances in which we find ourselves. The next trial will involve an exceptional level of magical skill and a nuanced ability to interact with beasts. Perfect. Just what I've been doing. Find a face of stone and tendrils. I should advise you that you must engage with any beast that is part of the trial on your own. Professor Bakar will meet you in his pensive room. Hmm. An exceptional level of magical skill? Nuanced ability to interact with beasts? Hmm. I suppose we should begin our search for a face of stone and tendrils. Whatever that may be. Very well. Professor Weasley has been keeping an eye on me. Perhaps we should meet there, so she has no reason to raise concerns with Professor Black. I shall see you near the coast. Perhaps then you can tell me a little more about the memories of Isadora that you witnessed. All right, so where is it at, my boy? Holy Jesus! It's a good thing I traveled this far, huh? It's a real good thing. <coughs> You're here. I have good news. We do not have any of Ranrock's loyalists to contend with. Of course, the bad news is that it's likely because they no longer need to track the Keepers for information. Revelio. This place could do with a bit of pruning. Let's look around. Incendio. Is that a... It is. What is that thing? Holy smokes, what was wrong with my camera? Do you recognize the head sculpted there? Uh, no. That's a head. I can't say that I do. It appears to be a fearsome beast known as a graphorn. Oh. And the prints carved into the ground lead me to believe that a graphorn will somehow open the way forward. That's what Professor Rackham meant when he spoke of my needing an ability to interact with beasts. It would seem so. I do know that the last of a long dynasty of the Graphorns lives nearby. They call him the Lord of the Shore. I suspect you'll need to bring him here. What happens next, I can't say. Okay. If that's what must be done, I'll do it. Excellent. I know this area well enough. When you see the remains of a large sea creature, you're in the right place. Now. Professor Rackham made it clear that you must engage with any beast that is part of this trial on your own. So I shall wish you good luck and wait for your return in the map chamber. 
Okay. Search for the Lord of the Shore. Holy bejeebas. Goodness. Not a party to attend by myself. Well, I'm out of here, boy. Get me out. Alright, let's see what this is all about down here. Well, what is this, though? Oh, it's one of these. Here's one of those tables Professor Shaw mentioned. Okay. There we go. Well, that's done. Revelio. All right. This must be the place. How the fuck am I gonna get down there? What the fuck? Oh, maybe because I go down here. Who Duh. Lives here, I wonder. So I'm assuming I gotta attain a grab horn. So what is this? I one? know a Merlin trial when I see one. So, but gotta be do something with those stones, but I'm not gonna be worried about it, so. Rebellion. Very well, Lord of the Shore. Show yourself. Uh oh. Oh, I was like, please don't tell me you fucking dodge it. Can't use that. Oh, fuck me. Oh my god, dude. Oh, 
Ah, you little fucker. Oh, no, dude, I am spamming the fucking circle button. you hold on Sometimes the fucking... There. Sick, dude. <clears throat> Let's get it, dude. This is fucking cool as shit. Dude, this is so cool. Poachers. Let's see how the Lord of the Shore feels about his neighborhood being invaded. Let's just fucking get him back. I'm not trying to have him be killed, so. It'll take more than this to stop the Lord of the Shore. Let's get this over with, shall we? This looks intriguing. We're crossing that bridge whether you like it or not. To race now, my friend. Sweet.
Oh. Oh shit, hold on. <laughs> Awesome. Cool. Now we have him now, so I'm going to put him in that one room, so... With my griffins. Alright. Now, what do we have Perhaps here? Perhaps Professor Rockham was right to have had faith in you. I still have my reservations. Isadora, as you will see, was not who she seemed. I can only hope that you are. My memories should answer any questions you may have about the power you will need to protect. Thank you, Professor Bakar. I shall see you back in the map chamber. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Whatever this power is, I low-key kind of want it. Now, do we Rebellion. have any chests in here? No chests? Nothing? Are you kidding me? Ah, uh, okay. Hello? Isadora? Isadora? Son, I'm glad you're here. Isadora was not at her home. I know. Her father. Percival. What is it? It is as though he was stripped not only of his pain, but of all emotion. Everything is much worse than I feared. Neve was right. Isadora hasn't stopped. I've just learned that she has been wielding that magic on students. We must gather the others. to return to your common room, all right? What have you done? Your breath. Students, Isadora. Everyone feels pain. And why? Because of your arrogance? Your obsession with secrets? He won't suffer any longer. Not my father. Not my students. No one. Isadora, set down your wand. Professor, you taught me to hone my power, not throw it away. I did not teach you this. Expelliarmus! Oh, damn!
Oh, shit. She's alive. Whoa, what's going on with my robe? What the hell? Did you see that? <laughs> oh man, this game gets glitchier and glitchier, dude. I can put my moveset back. The caverns below Hogwarts, where you fought Isadora. Is that the location of the final repository? It is. You see, we could not destroy the strands of emotion Isadora had stolen from so many. So we did all that we could to keep them safe. We also realized that until they could be destroyed, the magic used to create them was a danger to wizard kind. Hence, we became keepers. Keepers of an unfathomable secret. We knew that someday, one with the ability to see traces of ancient magic might be seduced by its power. We built the trials to lead that person to us, to allow them to prove themselves worthy of the knowledge we'd kept hidden and the responsibility that accompanies it. Have I not proven myself, Professor? I need to get to that repository before Ranrock does. You have, and you will. But the repository is protected by powerful ancient magic. To enter, you must craft a special wand from the four artifacts you found above our pensives. So the repository is safe from Ranrock for now. If he is, as you suspect, capable of using the power of the other repository, I fear he will be able to breach our defenses. Then I must go now and craft this wand. Perhaps Mr. Ollivander will help me. Another Ollivander? I'm not surprised. As I am sure he will tell you, this wand may be used for only one purpose. Return with the wand, and we will open the way forward. I shall send an owl ahead to Ollivander. Whilst you visit him, I'll reach out to Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley? Yes. I may have made an error in judgment by not informing her of Ranrock's intentions earlier. I only hope it's not too late. If Ranrock really is going to try to drill below Hogwarts, we'll need all the help we can get. All right, Professor. I'll see you soon. All right. So we got that done. And we got the new beast that I low-key want to put in our brand new room. Our buddy old pal should go in here. Aha! Uh -huh. Lord of the Shore. Here you go, dog. Eat some food. Those are some big old nugs for him, too. That's funny. his belly. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, let's see. So we gotta go out. But I wanna see what else I can upgrade for my clothes before we continue. As I should have fucking done the other ones. What the hell am I doing? Golly, man. What 
Oh, little dude. Revelio. I think that's everyone, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I don't need that many griffin feathers, I don't think. The one feather I know I need is the Neeful fur and the another fucking bird that I only have one of the... I forgot what it's called. But you know what I mean. Not the deer you call. Juggernaut, that's what I need. I think that's everybody, right? Pretty sure that's everybody. Dig thing. And I need more my fucking moon calves. I know I need that. Dude, back off. Oh my god. Y'all are so fucking annoying. Oh my god, dude. I want to fucking get this one. Holy smokes. I have two moon calves in here. What Rebellion. the fuck? Where's my other moon calf? Oh, there it is. Dude, it looks like it was eating its butt for a moment. There. Got that one. Get the fuck out of that one. Go in here. Go to my other aviary. 
What up, little dude? There. Now let's go ahead and upgrade my stuff. Upgrade my stuff. I think I know where we can find Doran. Meet me in the Forbidden Forest and we can tell him about the symbol the moon calves made. Okay. Finally we can upgrade this, dude. But before I do that, do I have any other loot? In that needs to, yeah, I have some loot that needs to be identified. I'll save it for now. I'll use it on my next set of clothing because I don't want to waste it, you know what I mean? But let's go talk to the Ollivander guy. See what he has to say. What are you up to now? There's Ollivanders. I hope he can help me craft the Keeper's Wand. What? Revelio. Oh, I was like, what? Hello, Mr. Ollivander. I wondered if you might be able to help me with something. Yes. Professor Fig sent an owl informing me that you'd be coming. He was a bit cryptic. Said you need to have a special wand crafted, that you'd bring me the materials. Yes, sir. I have them here. Oh, my. How extraordinary. Remarkable design. I will be honest, I have never crafted a wand in this fashion. Repaired broken wands, of course, but this is something else entirely. Keeping me on my toes, aren't you? I think I can work with what you've brought me. Let me see what I can do. It is done. Sheesh, dude, look at that. Styling. I should warn you, I've never seen a one like this before. My suspicion, as Professor Fig implied in his letter, is that it serves a unique purpose. I doubt you shall find much use for it otherwise. I understand. Thank you, sir. I'm afraid you're on your own. I've ensured that we have a moment to ourselves. Oh, come, come. No need for such theatrics. In light of what Ranrock now knows, you must agree that our interests are aligned. Our interests will never be aligned. You would let goblins take what is rightfully ours? The final repository belongs to wizard kind. We would be fools not to work together. What's that you've got there? 
Might this sudden visit to the wand maker have something to do with our mutual pursuit? I have no idea what you're talking about. That repository is my birthright! Charles Rookwood wouldn't have wanted you near it. <laughs> the arrogance. Should have known better than to try and reason with a child. I've always said, children should be seen and not heard. All right, what the hell? That was low-key kind of glitchy, though. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Oh, I can't use that on him? Are you fucking kidding me? Motherfuckers! Oh. 
Revelio. What? I can't a believe it. mission. Brookwood's reign is finally over. I'll need to send an Altanati right away. For now, though, I need to get back to the map chamber and tell Fig what happened. Ooh. What a mission, boys. I am not gonna lie. Alright, so I need to clear my freaking gear slots. Get rid of the stuff that I'm never gonna use. Like this stuff, the green stuff. Straight garbage. No one needs that. Rebellion. Hmm. This looks like trouble. What a freaking mission, boys. That was nuts. Hey, let's get it. Alrighty, I think this is a great place to leave off. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, please let me know by hitting that like button down below. And uh, if you are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below as well. I greatly appreciate your support. Without further ado, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching, and peace.